Hey guys, Sai is here and if you're a custom ROM user or if you unlock your phone bootloader then you may be face this issue. As we can see device integrity is not going to pass or if you are open this uh, play store application and go on this about section as we can see here it is device is not certified. Okay. So if this happening then you are not able to do payments like NFC payments or maybe some apps not working properly. So in this video, I will solve this problem. I will show you how to pass this device integrity, but uh, you need to have a rooted device because this method is working on rooted device. Uh, no matter your device is rooted with Magisk or kernel SU, I will cover both the methods in this video. But before move on the process, before starting the video, if you are new on this channel, then don't forget to subscribe. Also join our telegram channel where I provide important files and updates. So without any wasting of time, let's begin. So first of all, we need to have a rooted device as I previously first told that. Okay. So this is rooted. This device is rooted with kernel SU and here it is. This is my other device, which is rooted with Magisk. Okay. So first of all, uh, you need to download two modules. Okay. If you are using, if you are using kernel SU, then you need to download both modules, which is plain integrity fix and other one is Zygisk. Okay. But if you are a, Z a Magisk user, then you no need to download this second module, which is Zygisk. Okay. Just you need to download this play integrity. Okay. Okay. So first of all, I will show you how to fix on kernel SU. Okay. So first of all, open the kernel SU, then go on module section and click on install button. And just we need to install that module. So here it is. So first of all, we need to install this Zygisk. Okay, just wait few seconds, it will be installed. Okay, after installing successfully, here it is a reboot option is here, but don't click on reboot, go back and again click on install and install the second module which is play integrity fix. Okay, after installing this both modules, just click on reboot option. Okay, so here it is this uh, kernel, this process for kernel issue and now talking about Magisk. So what we what we need to do on Magisk, simple, just open Magisk, click on the settings, make sure that your Zygisk is enabled. Here it is, my Zygisk is already enabled. So this is mandatory, the Zygisk is enabled and here it is the um, option is showing Zygisk is equal to yes. Okay, so we need to note that first of all, Zygisk is enabled, okay. And go on in the module section and after that click on install from storage and install that play integrity fix module. That's it. Then click on reboot. After that, your device integrity fixed on Magisk. Let's talk about this kernel SU. So it's going to boot. Just wait some seconds. Okay, my device is booted successfully. Just unlock it. And first of all, open this kernel SU. And if I go on this module section, as we can see here, it is plain integrity fix module and Zygisk next module. This both modules are installed successfully. Okay. Now, first of all, what we need to do, just clear the play store app data. Okay. Uh, okay. Click on this play store app data. Okay. I cleared this play store app data after that go on settings and click on app section and also clear the play google play services data okay here it is the google play services and here it is storage and catch i click on this clear storage that's it both the both on both apps i clear the data okay now open integrity check apk just click on check now it will take some time. Okay, it depends on network server and internet as well. Okay, as we can see here it is now the device integrity is passed. Okay, uh, ignore this strong integrity. It's not matter for us, but make sure that this device integrity is passed. Okay, now you are good to go to use your payments. I mean NFC payment apps and Maybe if some other apps is not working, that apps also now working. Okay. Now open the play store and let's check the device is certified or not. 
so here it is as we can see here it is device is certified now okay so this is the solution okay so if you like this video then please like and share this video because upcoming videos are very interesting and useful okay so hit the like button and okay that's it see you in the next video love you guys goodbye take care